Hey, so this is a wonderful question and I get questions like this all the time. It's really important to remember to just not get too caught up in learning a phrase all the time, but understanding the parts of it. So if we look at this, ¿Cuál es tu nombre? ¿Qué es tu nombre? Well, three out of four of those words are the same, right? We're asking about someone's name. ¿Cuál and qué are two different words? That might sound really obvious, but sometimes when we're trying to remember a phrase, we forget that. So ¿Cuál means which? And que means what? And the nice thing is we use them pretty much the same way as we do in English. So if you think for a second about your native language, um, especially if it's English in this case, qual means which, que means what. So there's a difference in English as well when you say which is your name or what is your name. If you're asking which is your name, it means that you're choosing from a selection. So you can think, if you were showing up to an event and you have to find where your table is and somebody says, okay, which is your name? They're asking you to pick from the list that's on that, that piece of paper that you're looking at. But if they don't have a list and they need to know your name because they have the information to assign you to a table, then they're going to ask, what is your name? It's the same in Spanish. ¿Cuál es tu nombre? You can assume that they have a list of names, a group of names. They have information that they're trying to choose from and they need your help. So they're asking, which of these? Which one is it? Which is your name? But if they don't or if someone's meeting you for the first time or any other situation where you have to introduce yourself, it's because someone is asking, ¿Qué es tu nombre? What is your name? So I hope that's helpful. Remember, just don't overthink things too much. If you can speak one language, you can speak another language. Don't get too caught up in trying to do everything at once. Know that the a strong foundation and knowing the basics go a long, long way. All right, can't wait for the next question.